Hey guys, what's up? It's JC here with The Daily Fix. About to go check out the movie Her. It's supposed to be really good. I've only heard great things about it. So, let's go check it out. So, I just got back from seeing Her. And I haven't looked at anybody else's reviews. Haven't looked at... Um, I know our friends at SourceFed have done a review on this. As tempted as I was to watch it beforehand, I wanted to see it with my own perspective and I wanted to um, give you a review based on what I thought, not what uh, other people thought. So, man, holy cow, what a movie. Um, her was beyond anything that I've seen in a long time. Spike Jones, uh, the writer, director of this film, was did a phenomenal job. He knocked it out of the park. Uh, I definitely think that Spike Jones used the fact that he was both writer and director of this film to his advantage. Um, having been on both sides of the tape, um, I know how hard it is to either shoot somebody else's script and line up your visions that way, or as a writer to allow somebody to shoot your script and try and take what you have created and mold it into something different. Uh, it's very hard. So he definitely used that to his advantage, and everything about it was amazing. Um, the, the cinematography was awesome. The setting and how everything looked was beautiful. Um... As, as being set in the not so distant future, I'd imagine, because everything in this movie is great um, and possibly right around the corner. Joaquin Phoenix did an amazing job um, playing the role of Theodore and and portraying everything, and not even that, acting by himself uh, most of the time, not being able to talk, not talking to another person, but still. Um, showing emotion and dealing with stuff and and if he doesn't get nominated for an Oscar for this role uh, I will be blown away uh, because he was that good he did I would even say that he probably deserves to win it and I don't even know half the other movies that are coming out this year because um, what he had to do looking at Scarlett Johansson uh, who um, was wasn't even on the screen at all and you didn't see her, you only heard her, but you felt her. You felt her in every single scene that she was in, and it was great. Um, she did she did amazing. And you, you, you felt her presence. You knew she was there, you knew she was in the shots, uh, even though you didn't see her. Um, which is really hard to do. And uh, back to Joaquin, like you felt what he felt, you went through with what he went through. And it was ugh, so good. And a lot of that comes out of the writing of Spike Jones, but um, the other actors, Amy Adams uh, was awesome. Uh, loved seeing her. Uh, it was kind of a different from seeing I just saw American Hustle the other day. So to see her go from like revealing 70s attire to like sweaters and button ups um, up to the neck was like, it was cool. And she looked beautiful in it. She looked beautiful with her messed up hair and stuff. It was great. Um, uh, Chris Pratt, love seeing him. The moment I first heard his voice, I was like, hey, that's Chris Pratt. And I, I was super excited to see his role. And he was just funny and great, and I loved it. Um, man, such a good movie. Everybody in it. Everybody, even if you have the smallest part, Rudy Mara, uh, who we saw in a lot of um, flashbacks and dealing with her, uh, was awesome. And you know, she's like kind of the opposite of Samantha, where you don't you see her, but you don't hear her that much. Um, everybody, and it was awesome. Um, man, even um, the music of the movie was great. Uh, Arcade Fire apparently did all the music, or at least most of it. Um, and it's gonna it, it garnered attention, more attention for me for them. So I'm gonna check out more of their stuff, uh, which I know they've been around for a while, but I I don't remember ever really listening to them that much so I'm definitely going to check them out again but man just everything with this film was excellent um I can't I can't think of one thing that I really didn't like 
about it. There, it was just so good. Uh, my overall grade for the film is an A plus. Yeah, I think it was that good. Um, Twenty four. It her has set the bar high for 2014. Um, they may have gotten a little bit of a help because Jurassic World was bumped to 2015, but uh, the bar is set high. And so I'm looking forward to whatever what else this year has in store for us. Um, but her was amazing. Um, definitely probably one of my favorite movies, maybe even of all time. I have to relook at my list here. Uh, but it was that good. It was just everything about it. So good. Well, we'll catch you again next time. Uh, deuces.